Sisters. Welcome back to KGTR. I'm Madison. And I'm Bobby. Last week, we went around to all of your favorite teachers and got some mean tweets. Favorite? Alright, let's just say they were pretty creative. Let's check them out. At Caramalis, you change your name more than you put in grades. <laughs> At Mr. Scott, it will forever and always come back to Joseph Campbell's The Hero's Journey. Yes, it will. It says, at Seth Dubois, I never knew a midlife crisis had a face. It's not even funny. It's just me. <laughs> at Barclay Hearts, Angelina Jolie, why you always, why you gotta always call on me when I don't know the answer? Is that Brayden? Or Kane? At Caramalis. Please let me go to the bathroom during your class. <laughs> Five minutes to walk to Magnet Hall and go is not enough. Hashtag gonna burst. <laughs> Todd underscore sharp. How much would someone have to pay you to actually teach? And Coach Dove, <laughs> you look like Cleveland from Family Guy. Oh, that's nasty. <laughs> really? <laughs> At Barclay Hearts, Angelina Jolie. Oh, I get it. I love Angelina Jolie. Okay. Ever heard of an online textbook? Carrying around conversations is like carrying around a brick. I appreciate that you used a simile. Good job. At Mr. Scott. <laughs> you look like Woody from Toy Story, just without the beard and hat. <laughs> that's uh, that's pretty good. At DeVille, you look like Walter White from Baking Bad. Hashtag, should have taught chemistry. It's Breaking Bad. What did I say? Baking, Baking. Bad. <laughs> Well, maybe I should have taught English, and that way everybody could just be stupider for what I have to say. Thanks a lot. Thank you, Phil. I'm done. I'm done. This is, no, this is over. This is Scott. And it just says I'm ugly. That's all it says. <laughs> that was easy. Like one of them? No, that's what everybody thought, which was great, but I love them. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Never. They're anonymous. Violence so. is never anonymous. Yes. I won't be teaching anymore if you call that teaching facilitating. I'll be walking around with a walkie-talkie. So if you see me, your day has not gone well. <laughs> hey, Woody! Hey, Rex! Why you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh, my God! Hey, Gators! In this segment, we walk around school and ask people completely fake questions just to see what their reactions are. This is the homecoming edition, so check it out! Uh, what do you think about Migos coming to Shreve and being the DJ at Homecoming? Uh, that would be awesome because they they keep the summer lit. All right, all right. I for like sure, that. It's sure. gonna be lit. I'm gonna get turned up. You know, that way. <laughs> that way. What do you think about the new Homecoming dress policy that outlaws the showing of skin? Um, I think it should be more reasonable. Like if it's not eight inches below the knees, then it's not dress code policy. <laughs> You know, you're wearing a fresh suit, you shouldn't take it off, you should style. Yeah. Um, I've never been to homecoming, so I've never experienced the dress policy, so yeah, I'm looking up. <laughs> me, me, me. Coach Bro, how do you feel about being selected the DJ for homecoming? Well, it's a dream come true. It's a job I've always wanted, and I just hope the kids are ready to dance, and you can't touch this. We're here with KGTR, and I'm Abby. And I'm Jacob. And it's homecoming season. And we're here to give you some helpful tips on how not to ask somebody to homecoming. Hey, Ella, you want to go to homecoming with me? As if. Go to homecoming! or not to go to homecoming? That is the question.
Will you go to homecoming with me? Uh, no. Will you go to homecoming with me? Uh, no. No. Maybe next year. No. 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 <laughs> of course. Of course. Always. Always. Sure, dude. <laughs> Will you go to homecoming with me? Yeah, of course. Wait, really? No. Oh. <laughs> so I'm here by the ask Patricia Johnson homecoming. I'm gonna see if she wants to tackle it with me. What are you doing? Uh, practicing for my homecoming proposal. Okay. In interesting poster. Hey. You want to watch? Sure. Yeah. Hey. Don't hurt yourself. <sighs> and so that's how Henry VIII became king. Yes, Elliot. Well, I don't have a question for you. It's for Lucas. Lucas, do you want to go to homecoming with me? No. That wouldn't have happened to Henry VIII. That's a wrap for today's show. I'm Lauren. And I'm Laura. See you next week on KGTR.